What's going on everybody, AQX underscore you here, otherwise known as Aqua. Today I am here to show you guys how to get your NPWD camera working. So we are here in my 5M server, and I'm just going to show you guys um, pretty much what the uh, camera essentially is like does before you set it up. So if you try to take a picture, it'll just do this loading thing, and it'll say create slash update request failed. And then if we go over to our... Server live console as you can see here. It says failed to upload photo status code 400 could not find token Please provide your token in the body. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do all of that stuff So let's go ahead and close out of our 5m server here So now that we've closed out of our 5m server, we're gonna go ahead and open a new tab. And we're just gonna pull up NPWD here we're going to go to here, and we're going to go down to their documentation. Now, their documentation is very useful. If you ever get stuck on anything, be sure to read their documentation, and it could uh, tell you anything you need. Or you can join my Discord, link in the description below, and uh, I can try to help you out as best as I can. So here we are. They have a setting up camera functionality page here that's going to tell us exactly what we need to do. Um, there's a couple different ways you can do it. You can use Error Media, Imgur, and Discord. Uh, Error Media is really good because you can get voice messages, however, it is paid for, so you will have to pay for this. I personally use Imgur, um, but you can also use the Discord channel, which we will go over today. So, we're going to go to their Imgur page here, and uh, you're going to want to go ahead and just go to the Imgur website, you know, create a uh, account, as you do. And then all you're going to do is you're going to go to this link. I'll put the link in the description below. You're going to go to this link, you're going to make a name, so you can name it, you know, YouTube server images or whatever. You're going to choose OAuth 2 authorization without a callback. Application website, you don't need. Just put your email there and then put a description. And it's pretty much going to pop up with two different things. It's going to pop up with your, um, your client ID and your other thing. You only need your client ID, so just go ahead and copy your client ID, and that's all you're going to need. Then... Uh, I'll put this in the link in the description below as well. You're just going to copy this right here. You're going to go back to your server console. You're going to go to your uh, server.config. And right here under your MySQL connection string, that's where I like to put it, you're just going to come right under that and paste that in. So it's set screenshot basic token and then your client ID. Now you're going to go ahead and copy your client ID and you're just going to paste that on in there. Just like that. Now go ahead and save that. Now you're already halfway done. So the next thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go ahead and open up your files. I'm going to do that right now. Here we are in my server files. I'm going to go into my NPWD phone. I'm going to go to the config.json. And then I will leave it linked in the description below. Uh, but you will need this. You're just going to copy all of that. I have it in a different tab here. As you do. So what you're going to do is you're just going to come down to the very bottom of your uh, your config. And you're going to come right under the default contacts. You're going to add a comma right at the end of that. You're going to go enter. And you're just going to paste yours in. And then it should just be just like this. It should be images, uh, type should be imgur, all that stuff. Go ahead and save that. Put it back in your server if you have to, if you have to edit it outside your server. Go ahead and close out of that if you want to, and then go ahead and restart your server. So as we go ahead and connect to our 5M server here, um, I would like to go ahead and promote two different things. I'd like to promote one, my personal Discord server. I mentioned it a little bit earlier in the disc in the video. We are trying to gain new members for my Discord server, so I would really appreciate it if you could join that. And, uh, you know, just come hang out with us. Maybe you need some help. I could try to help you the best as I can. I'm not a resource developer, so I did not make this resource. Um... So I can try to help you as best as possible, but there is no guarantees there. Um, if you have another resource that you might be having problems with, uh, you could try to I, you could join, and I could try to help you with those too. Um, and then, you know, we're also just looking for general members to come and hang out. We're trying to grow the Discord. I'm trying to go the Discord server. It's just my personal Discord server. Apologize if you can hear that uh, dog barking in the background. Um, and then on another note, uh, Mountain View Roleplay is my personal uh, 5M roleplay server. Um, we're all constantly looking for new members for all of our different departments. So if you uh, would like to join that, I will leave that linked in the description below, and we do really appreciate that. So we're here in our 5M server, and I'm going to just go ahead and open up my phone, go to my camera, and if I hit the plus icon, and maybe turn the camera around, 
take a picture of myself, it should get uploaded. And there you go. Now your camera is working. You can, like, copy the image URL. Uh, you can delete it. Uh, you can, you know, text people uh, your stuff. I could, I could make a tweet with a picture. Um, I could add, uh, wait, do this, go camera, take a picture. Uh, we can go to Twitter, go here, um, add media, no. That, there we go. And then all we're going to say is, I have a working camera, thanks to AQX, I swear you. <laughs> Boom, there we go, tweet. There you go. Now, as you can see, it's all up there. People can click on it, you know. It does capture your HUD, unfortunately, but, you know, that's just something. Oh, I forgot to. There we go. If you want to get the picture to go away, just click just click into your phone again. Uh, if you, like, try to click out, it won't do anything. Click into your phone, and it'll go away. Uh, yeah, thank you guys all so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.